Hello there, and assalamu alaikum. Today's video is dedicated to all the GTA fans as we'll be learning to make the iconic GTA text style. So let's get started. Let's create a new document and we'll keep it 3000 by 3000 pixels and let the color mode be RGB and resolution I am happy with 300 and let's hit create. All right, so for this tutorial, you'll need to have price down font installed into your computer. So if you don't have it, fret not. As I've mentioned, the link in the description from where you can download it. Once the font is selected, let's update the font size to 550 pixels, which is about 132 points. And now we'll start typing. So let's type grand and uh, you'll see how perfectly this font matches to the actual grand theft auto signature style font. For further text, let's just duplicate this layer by dragging it to create a new layer icon of the layers panel. Now, since the layer has been duplicated, the duplicate layer text is sitting right on top of the original one. So just drag it down and update the text to theft. And in the same way, duplicate the layer once last time for auto. Now let's rearrange the three words, much like in the video game before merging the layers together. And now that our text is all set, let's merge the three layers. So to do that, let's just select the three text layers, holding command on a Mac or control on a PC and left clicking them. And let's go to layers option on top and then merge layers. You can even use the shortcut command E on a Mac or control E on a PC to merge the layers. You'll find that the three text layers have become one now in the layers panel on the right. So now right click on this merge layer and go to blending options uh, right at the top of this menu. Once open, check color overlay option on the left panel. And uh, you don't have to change a lot of things here. Just change the color to white and hit OK. Now with the same merged layer selected, right click on it and choose rasterize layer style. Rasterizing converts a vector layer to pixels and that's exactly what we're trying to achieve here. Once that's done, right click on it once again and go back to blending options and check the stroke option on the left menu and change the structure size to 40 pixels, uh, position to outside uh, let the blend mode to be normal and opacity to be 100%. So that should do the job. Now go to layer and then layer style and then select create layer to create a new layer using a layer style. A layer style is different from layer effect. It's a collection of two or more layer effects working together to create a larger overall look. Uh, whereas layer effects are the individual effects themselves like drop shadow or stroke or outer glow and so on. Now you need to control click on the thumbnail of the text layer to make a selection of this layer. You'll find marching ants all around the text at this point. So select the auto's outer stroke layer and go to layer once again. Uh, and this time go to layer mask and height selection to create a layer mask that hides the selected area of the layer. You'll find that the layer in the middle has a mask attached to it now. So right click on the layer mask and choose apply layer mask. Then right click on the text layer and choose blending options. Next, uh, check the inner shadow style from the menu on the left and update the blending mode to multiply. And uh, this time change the opacity to about 80%. Uh, angle should change to around, uh, let's keep it 150 degrees. Change the distance to zero. Choke to be updated to 40%. 
and let the size be 5 pixels and then you can hit OK alright so once again you've got to right click on the autos outer stroke layer and again go back to blending options and this time check the stroke style and update the structure size to 5 pixels and position to inside blend mode to normal and opacity should already be 100% color needs to be changed to white before hitting OK now to make our layers panel look neat control click on both the top two layers to select them and then go to layer and then new and then group from layers to create a new group from the selected layers and name it anything I'll name it GTA text all right now our text is ready so we just need to align it to center so press command A on a Mac or control A on a PC on your keyboard to make a selection of the canvas and uh, choose the move tool and click on align vertical center from top and also align it to horizontal and there you go your Grand Theft Auto text is ready alright so if you've enjoyed the video please like share and subscribe to my channel and I shall see you in the next one pretty soon signing off thank you